I'm pretty bad at Family Feud. 99.9% .9 of my audience doesn't know this, and for a good reason. But I'm about to tell you now why. Two and a half years ago, when I was a much smaller creator, I joined an event called Pokethon. It was a Pokemon charity event where a bunch of creators flew out to California and we raised money for Direct Relief. It's actually how I met my best friend, Pokemon7. At this event, I was probably the smallest creator as I just played Pokemon cards. But on the very last day, they were hosting a family feud event called Pokethon Feud. And being a huge fan of the show, I was like, ah, this is going to be really fun. I myself have watched pretty much every single Family Feud video that's viral on YouTube. And I'm sure a lot of you have. Then you think, oh, I'm going to be really good at this. And then when you step up to the mic, everything goes wrong. It turns out that my ADHD brain likes to say things before my brain is able to completely understand what I've said. So much so that at that event, something viral happened. During the fast money round where you have 20 seconds to give a bunch of answers, I was following up Jay Wits, who was one of my favorite content creators at the time and still is. Jay Wits, if you're watching this, please, I'm so sorry. He had scored a ton of points for the team and I was in a separate room and had to come in and only score a few points. And it went, well, I'll just show you. Right, name a psychic type Pokemon. Elgium. <laughs> name a Pokemon. <laughs> clip. Please clip that. My boy. <laughs> <laughs> he started so nice with the nine, and I was like, okay. The second Elgium came from his lips. Elgium. Yeah. After this happened, I literally got kicked off my team. Am I being punched right now? Is this a sabotage? Who donated to throw my game? I went over to the green room and I was kind of sad because I really loved Family Feud and I really blew my opportunity in front of a bunch of people. But then they gave me my moment. At the very end, someone had scored a bunch of points again. And one content creator said this. Bring Purple Clip in. Bring Purple in. Clip instead. So I went back at it again. Things couldn't be worse from the last time of saying Elgium. Or could they? What appliance would you not add a Rotom to? Vending machine. <laughs> Pick another one! Okay, we're gonna finish! We're gonna finish! Pick another How do you answer these correctly? Yeah, that was on the front page of Twitch. It was such a big moment that they even got it animated. Yeah, I was gonna Wait! I really hate it if a Rotom took over my vending machine! So I left this event as a small creator being known as the Elgium guy. Wasn't the greatest, but I got invited back the next year. And for some reason, they made me do every single fast money round, every single one. And you'd think, oh, he had an entire year to prepare for this. I did it again. Name a purple Pokemon. Oh God, Gulpin, no. Which, which <laughs> Gulpin, I, why? Now, this was just when I started blowing up on TikTok. I had about 5,000 subscribers on YouTube and about 200,000 on TikTok. So it didn't really explode everywhere and become a meme until this last weekend where I participated in this charity event again. And um, let's just say I'm really, really bad at Family Feud. This do team it. does Don't not do appreciate my answer. It's a good answer. It's a, it's the number one on the board. It's the number it's the number one on the board. The worst Nintendo character would to be a Pokemon trainer is Goomba. <laughs> Please be on the board. Number one. Come on. Type one in chat. Show me. They're gonna be proper nouns. No! It could have been on the board, man. Forget Detective Pikachu, you need a blank as your partner Pokemon to solve some mysteries. I have the answer that I'm stealing from the top team. Okay. Um, uh. They were gonna say Stoutland. Stout? No! <laughs> I, don't, I don't know if I'm very confident about that. That, that was not uh, one of our top uh, picks. Uh, I just wanna clarify. <laughs> <No. laughs> um, uh, you could have that one. Uh, <laughs> It's, it's the Pokemon that sniffs out items in the game! 
What else? What? That's like the best detective. All right, it's yeah. Stalin. Yeah. Stalin, he's, the final answer. It. All right. Show me Stalin. Unfortunately, not one of the top five. Going into this event with a very large following was interesting because they had the option for $50 to switch a member on a different team. I kept getting switched. $50 from Unigoat JJ says, um, swap Purple Cliff and Jaywitz. Oh, our first <laughs> swap. Of team rules. <laughs> swap Purple Cliff and Reversal. Swap Purple Cliff and True Green 7, even though they're on the same no, team. But wait, the same but team. wait, then, <laughs> then $50 from Jufumu who says, switch it back. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Woo! High five! It's that's for a great cause. In the end, Boom. that's $115 for charity, and nothing has changed. Swap, Purple Cliff, and Elliot. You swapped them? Man. Oh, no. That's a whole, a whole grand? Help! Yeah. Help, I'm stuck! <laughs> Help! We lost Cliff, everybody! Swap, Elliot, and Purple Cliff. <laughs> Another 50 from Purple Golfin, who says... Purple Golfin? <laughs> okay. That's, that's okay. Purple okay. Golfin, who says... Swap, Purple, and Pulse. Why do what can I just listen? I feel like I'm in middle school again, going between my mom and my dad's house. All right, can we just pick a team and just leave me there and start like, like I'll get a backpack. Listen, I already got my clothes packed. Okay, here I'm coming down to bottom team. Oh God, dang. Someone DM'd me a news article called "The Psychological Effects of Divorce on Children." Can they just pick a spot and keep me there? And then we got to the fast money round, where again. I was given a ton of points, and it was very hard for me to mess it up. I messed it up. <laughs> I feel like contractually, you guys have to put Cliff on. You just no, oh, no. Yeah. Oh, I no. It. I wasn't saying anything, so like people could be like, oh, we want to do it. And I'm like, awesome, yeah. I'm not going to make a fool of myself again. So Gabby did pretty fantastic, <sighs> scoring you 177 points. You just need 23 points. <sighs> It Not order. again. You guys can't keep putting me in these situations, man. You can't put me in these situations. Name a green Pokemon. Uh, Gulpin. <laughs> Name a fighting type Pokemon. I couldn't hear. Everyone was laughing. Name a fighting type Pokemon. Hitmonchan. What is the best held item in the game? Everstone. <laughs> Besides Lucario, name a Pokemon that starts with the letter L. You can pass and go on. Lombre! Uh, Lombre, okay. Uh, on a scale of one to 10, how difficult is Cynthia's battle? 10. 10. Not okay. just the battle. Name a green Pokemon. Gabby starting off with the number one answer. Bulbasaur, Cliff said. Gopin. Good answer. Survey Good answer. said. There yeah. were some people. Yeah. Name a fighting type Pokemon you said. Hitmonchan! Oh, wait, wait! Survey said! Why are you the Hitmon line? There you ah, go! Yeah. There you go! Amazing! You hit it! What's the best held item in the game? You said... Everstone. The Everstone. <laughs> and survey says... <laughs> Winners! <laughs> Woo! I, I see glowing sparkles. That must mean it was a good answer. That's the shiny. Uh -huh. Besides Lucario, name a Pokemon that starts with the letter L you said. Come on. Come on. Lombre. Lombre. Come on. Survey Come on. said. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! Winners! Winners! Scale of 1 to 10, how tough is Cynthia's battle you said? 10. A nice 10, and the survey said? Me. Liars! Yes! Liars! But at least this time we won, so... That was cool. I didn't completely embarrass myself until this question when I was given the buzzer. Name a Pokemon to describe your love life. <laughs> I'll creamy. <laughs> <laughs> Sir. <laughs> Sir. Show me I'll He's creamy. <laughs> <laughs> Take mine. Take mine. I love the what? confidence. The confidence is the best part. Who are they surveying for these things? If it's not Ditto, it's for sure Licky Licky. <laughs> <laughs> Show me Ditto. Yeah. What? I knew it. I knew it. No. I knew it. Things weren't going so well for me, but the Twitch chat was loving it. Steph Harvey, I'm going to go with Chaytot. 
Who? <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> I've never heard that word said that oh, way. Oh, come on! Not you too! <laughs> I d there's no winning. There's no winning. It's not. Ahem. Show me. Chat tot. <laughs> the number yeah. one answer. Yeah. I had a lot of fun with this, but then I needed to step up and actually get some points during the very final fast money round. My teammate Gabby got 170 points, or that's what they told me. She actually got 17. So I needed to step it up. If we were to win this, I would need to score 183 points. And well, watch. Which Pokemon region has the best tasting food? Alola. Name a Pokemon you'd want as a house pet. Low putty. <laughs> <laughs> Name an overpowered TM. Um, uh, Earthquake. Name an underrated Pokemon. Low putty. <laughs> Ooh. Name a support Pokemon. <laughs> You better put the same answer. <laughs> oh, 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 uh, uh Seiju Park, Pachirisu, please, oh, come on, come on, come on. Good answer. Okay. Come okay. on. The All law right. punnies, though, I gotta <laughs> ask about. Oh my God. Okay, don't worry about it, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go through these answers. Which Pokemon region had the best tasting food? You said. Oh. Alola, survey Good said. Answer. Name a Pokemon you'd want as a house pet, you said. <laughs> Chad! Yes! <laughs> it was not I should have, I should have, I, I, I would have, I, I, I would have retweeted the poll had my Twitter account not been banned. Name an overpowered TM, you said. Earthquake. Great answer. Earthquake. This is the carry. 80, Survey 80 said. That's number 92. one. Oh, oh, nice. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. There's a chance. There's a chance. Name an underrated Pokemon. You said. Nope. Come on, Lopany. <laughs> <laughs> Survey says. Oh, oh I, I miss. I miss. Reddit. <laughs> Name a support Pokemon. We edited it to say 88. Cheating is allowed. Chat will just pretend they don't see it. All right, name a, name a support Pokemon. You said Pachirisu, survey said. Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> oh my God. We did it! Woo! Oh my God, did it, actual, didn't even, didn't even have to cheat. <laughs> I don't know if I should ever play Family Feud, but I do know one thing. If Steve Harvey were to grab YouTubers and ask me, I would say yes in a heartbeat and probably have a viral video of me embarrassing myself in front of the world. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, press like. I guess I'll see you next year with more Family Feud. <laughs> Pain.